all right guys welcome to this tutorial where i'm going to show you how to add a transition to all your clips okay let's say you have a bunch of clips that you want to add the one transition to so in this case let's say we um uh let's say let's cut the clips up real quick let's get the blade tool and cut and cut cut them up right so you can do that. So what you want to do if you want to add um, a transition to all these clips here, you want to add the same transition. All you got to do is uh, you select the clips. Let's go back to V. You select all the clips you want to add a transition to. And then you simply click Shift D. Okay, so see, it has the dissolve thing on it. So for example, let's say there's nothing here. So you can see it to work. It's going to do that. So you're not going to see anything because this is like, you know, these are the same clips. But if it, um, if it was mixed up, then you would see the effect at work. Okay. So let me just do a quick example here for you guys. Okay. Let's bring this up here. Let's bring this here. Stream it in. And then bring this here. So these are different clips here so let's do shift z i'm sorry shift d shift d so bow see the transition is working see that yeah so that's how you do it guys um that's how you add a transition to multiple clips one transition so let's say all these are different clips and you want to just add the same transition this is just an example of course you have to arrange them how you want them so if you want to add the same transition in this case i have um, dissolve as the default transition so you can change the default transition by going to the video and then go here and you see dissolve is my um default transition because it has the blue thing in it so if you want to if you want the dip to black to be your default transition you can just um right click and then set selected as default transition and now it's dip to black and then you can just go select the clips you want in this case all these clips and then you can just shift d and then that transition say dip to black will be added to all the transition to all the clips so guys that's how you do it that's how you add um that's how you add um a transition to multiple um, clips so when it comes to audio let's say um, for example let's do this bow okay okay so let's say you want these to kind of like you know not overlap each other but you know i usually do it like this when i'm editing right kind of like they can blend into each other so instead of um adding the fade to just the one clip here in audio let me bring up the audio as audio right here transitions so instead of just doing the fade to black like that instead of doing bow and then bow and then of course you know you can trim this right so what you do is instead of doing all that you can just do let me just go back you can just select all the ones you want and then shift D C and then they can just be trimmed to your liking like that But if you don't want to go through the hard work of um, um, kind of like trimming them one by one like this, what you can do is just you can copy, bow, So that's how you do it, guys. That's how you do it. So you just click Shift D. I'm working on a Mac, so. This is for people that use Mac. So Shift D adds the default transition to either the audio or the video. 
So this is for people that do um, multiple eclipse editing like I do with weddings. So I hope this helps you guys because it really helps me a lot when I'm editing wedding videos, especially full wedding videos. Okay, guys. So um, that's that. I hope this really helps you. And if it did, please subscribe to the channel if you're not yet. And if you are, please click the like button and also check out the eight cinematic lots in the link on the description below, the first link in description. Thank you guys. Cheers.